A police officer in Arlington, Texas, busted a 19-year-old who was smoking marijuana outside of a movie theater. So what did this cop do uh, to punish this teenager? Well, instead of arresting him and putting him in jail, he decided to make the teen do 200 push-ups, which I love. I, this is a perfect example of a cop using good human judgment, punishing the teenager, and uh, not going overboard with that punishment. So uh, we do have a picture of the teenager doing the push-ups. There's a video, it went viral, it's all over social media if you want to check it out yourself. Um, he, his form could use a little work, but to be fair, <laughs> it's 200 push-ups. 200 is so. a lot of goddamn push-ups, really Jesus. Yes. Yes. Apparently he was also alternating between doing push-ups on his knees and then just straight out push-ups. Oh, yeah, well, those which don't is, count. No, no I respect that. Push-ups are do, hard. They are. 200 push-ups is really, really hard to do. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. a whole body workout. You got Maybe your core, your legs, your yeah. arms. It's such a great thing to do. When you wake up in the morning, do like 20 push-ups. Even like if you're not your caught with marijuana, just do the 20 push-ups. Seriously, it is a good full body workout. It but is. nonetheless, I love this cop. See, like there are great cops out there. And I know that they don't get covered nearly enough because, you know, the, the hideous stories of people who are unarmed getting shot and killed typically make the headlines. But cops like this are great. Yes, use human judgment. It's just pot, right? Don't ruin a teenager's life just because he was smoking marijuana, which I think 90% of teenagers do anyway. So this story, for me, is very strange. So this guy was smoking weed outside the movie theater. His mom was, like, I, I want to be high a lot, but never around my mother. Like, not, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I, I rarely am ever just He's like, so this paranoid. movie would be so much better watching, what is it, what I see? Like, watching uh, La, La, La La Land with my mom would be way better if I was blazed. No, it would be worse. So, so nervous. And <laughs> so paranoid. stressed. I'd be so stressed. She knows. Yeah, she, she knows. knows. She I'd be like, Emma Stone knows. She's probably Everyone this. knows. Okay. <laughs> Emma Stone. <laughs> Emma, Emma Stoned knows that I'm stoned. As you might be able to tell, we're a little pro pot here. We, we're mainly pro legalization. Um, but that doesn't mean you should do it on private property, somebody else's private property. Correct. Yeah. And so he, he shouldn't have done that. And my favorite part of it so Eric Ball, the, the officer here, great job in exercising judgment. And it's not like he let him off. Right, and so and his it mom sucks knows to do now, the and his mom plans on punishing him yeah, further. Yeah, three different things there. One, it sucks to do push-ups on the sidewalk. All kidding aside, mm -hmm, right, mm -hmm. in front of everybody. Mm -hmm. And and number two, your mom's going to find out he's underage, and then he's going to get a you know a talking to at least. Mm -hmm. um, and number three, two hundred ain't no joke, right? right? Uh, and okay, uh, my favorite part of the video was when the mom was thanking the officer. Yes, and she said. He's not going to have a criminal record. He's going to be able to get a job. Thank you. And thank you for finding that he was doing it and letting me know and punishing him, but not doing it in a way that ruins his life. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. So good policing is possible and it exists and it's all over this country. We just happen to get this one on tape, right? Mm -hmm. uh, so when we point out the policing that's gone wrong, it's not in an effort to dislike cops. It's in an effort to hopefully make the situation better so that we can do more stories like this. So we feel like the, the cops are protecting us and serving the community. We're in the community. Yes. That's what we want. So we want to be proud of our cops and say, great job. You know who's going to stop Trump, stop the establishment, stop the corruption? You are. You help us hire new investigative reporters, and we will unleash it on them. TYTnetwork.com slash go. Let's build the best journalism team in America.